What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, so today, um, I haven't posted in a while. I'm sorry about that. But today, I'm doing a um, going to do a full collection update. Um, and I took, I said I was going to do it now. It's halfway through the year. I don't have any models on order or anything. Um, so I just thought, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna show off some of my plans here, all my plans, um, and kind of also go through plans for each collection each part of my collection, so, like, each airline, like, for Delta and American and stuff, um, but, yeah, anyway, so we're gonna get started here, um, we're starting with, uh, with Delta, so we're gonna start with this, um, Delta Connection CRJ700 by Gemini Jets, these two 900s are both by Gemini Jets, this one is the, um, the one on the left here, this is the 2020 release, and the one on the right is the, um, latest release, we have my Embraer 175. So now we have um, all of my mainline stuff. So we'll start with this A220-300 by Gemini Jets. A319 also by Gemini Jets. A320 by Gemini Jets. Um, A320 by NG. A321 by NG. A321 Neo by Gemini Jets. So that's, um, that's all the Airbus stuff. Here's all this Delta stuff now. We have two 717s. Um, they're the same release and everything. 738, that's the original release. 738 um, in the Atlanta Braves. Um, with the, it's got the Atlanta Braves um, nose art. 739 by Gemini Jets as well. Um, 752 by ANG. 753 by Gemini Jets. 767-300 by Gemini Jets. 767-400 Gemini Jets. Now we have this A330-300 by Gemini Jets. This is the original release of that model. A330 Neo by Gemini Jets. 330 Neo Team USA, also by Gemini Jets. 350-900 by Gemini Jets. 350-900 Team USA by Gemini Jets. And 747-400 by Gemini Jets. So that's the Delta. Um, so the eventual plan for this collection is to add, um, at least a 767-300 with winglets, um, and a 220-100, maybe a few more duplicates of a few planes, um, a 330-200, and probably another 330 that doesn't have, like, a paint chip, but 330s are so expensive. Um, and definitely beef up this, um, uh, connection fleet here. But anyway, that's the, um, Delta. Delta fleet, we're gonna get started back here with American. We have this um, CRJ200 by Gemini Jets. CRJ700 by Gemini Jets. This Dash 8 um, in the um, Piedmont Retro livery by Gemini Jets. 320 by Gemini Jets. 321 Neo by Gemini Jets. 737-800 in the flagship Freedom by NG. 737 Max 8 by Gemini Jets. And 777-300ER by Gemini Jets. So my plan for the American fleet um, is to grow some, get a 319, um, maybe get a standard A321, get a 757, and get at least a 787 um, as well. So now we're going to move on to United, um, starting with the CRJ200 Battleship Grey, 737-700, um, that's by Gemini, that's by NG. Um, 737-800 in the um, Rise of Skywalker livery. This one is, it's one of my favorites. Um, this one's by NG. Um, 738 by Gemini Jets, or 73 Max 8 by Gemini Jets. And 752 by NG. Um, and then um, we have this Alaska 739 by, um, in the One World Livery by Gemini Jets. So the plan for United is to grow it a little bit, get a 321 Neo, get more of these um, Evo Blue liveries. Um, as well so get a 739 get some maxes in there you know and as far as um alaska just get more 737s in different liveries um kind of just grow that out a little bit um so we're going to come all the way down here to all these low cost airlines now we have southwest so this is 737 700 by aero classics um 737 700 maryland one by ng 738 um by jim burger high ng 738 Canyon Blue by NG. 738 Freedom One by NG. And then Nevada One by Gemini Jets. That's a new model that you haven't seen um, in the collection. 
that's actually one of that's the second newest um this 744 you have seen it um but you and you've seen that one um that team usa i'm trying to think of ones that you might not have seen oh y'all didn't know i had duplicates of a couple of delta ones but um yeah you haven't seen those and or the 321 um anyway the american 321 um anyway bye Anyway, we're going to move on to, um, or we'll get this silver ATR here real quick by Gemini Jets. That's a 42. Um, so now we're going to move on to JetBlue. 320, or 220 by Gemini Jets. Yes, an A220, 300. 320 by Gemini Jets in the high-rise livery. 320 in the old livery. Um, I think that's the bubble tail by Gemini Jets. And then the 321 XLR by Gemini Jets. So we'll move now. To the um to these three low cost airlines here, um, Breeze A two or E one nine E one ninety, oh gosh, E one nine five by Gemini Jets, Spirit A three twenty Neo by Gemini Jets and Frontier A three twenty Neo by Gemini Jets. So the plan for all of these airlines is to just grow, especially JetBlue and Southwest. Um, get more um state liveries for Southwest. Um, Silver don't really have any plans for Silver. Um. And then for Breeze, get an A220, get a couple more Spirits, and a few more Frontier planes. Um, so that's kind of the plan. Um, let's move on down here real quick. We'll get these two um, Allegiance. We have this A319 by Gemini Jets and this A320 by Gemini Jets. That A320 was actually the second or the third model in my collection. The um, 777 was my second model in my collection. The American one was. Um, so we're going to come back here. We'll get these retros real quick. I'm sorry. I'm all over the place with this. I just set things up and was like, I'm going to film a video because I haven't filmed one in, or I haven't uploaded a video in a few months. I filmed a few videos. Didn't really do much anything. Anyway, um, Pan Am, um, DC-10 by Postage Stamp, TWA 747 um, SB. That's one you have not seen yet. You've not seen that model at all. Um, but that one's by Gemini Jets, and then the ONA DC-8, um, by Gemini Jets as well. So we got the two, um, we got the two private aircraft, the two BBJs. We have Donald Trump's 757, and we have this private, um, 737-700. I'd love to get more of the private jets, um, and I'd love to get more retro planes. I want to get some, I want to get some Eastern stuff, um, maybe more Pan Am and more TWA. I love Pan Am. TWA is also pretty cool, especially that livery and the, their latest livery was pretty, pretty cool too. Um, ONA is just one of those obs obscure airlines you never heard of, but it's still a really cool airline. I really like that model. Um, anyway, I really like all these models. Um, there's only a few of them that I would not recommend. Um, anyway, we're going to get started here. We have the Canadian stuff now. Air Canada A220, WestJet um, 737-700, and Porter Q400. Um, so plan is get a Porter E195, E190 E2, get another WestJet like a 737-800, and get a couple more Air Canadas, maybe even heavy. Um, that'd be great. All right, we're going to move all the way down here. We have, um, these are my Latin American planes, starting with my Aeromexico 739, Gemini Jets. Um, and my Aero Mexico Travel, MD-82, also Gemini Jets. Um, my Cubana, Bill 62, by Gemini Jets. And my TU-154 by Phoenix. And my Avianca 737, or A320, oh gosh, A320 and the Taka Retro Livery by Gemini Jets. Um, and both of those private jets are by Gemini Jets as well. Um, and all three of the Canadian ones too. I, I can't remember if I mentioned that or not. Um, all right, so now we have some heavies. We're gonna get started on the heavies. Actually, we're gonna get started over here with this Ryanair 737-800 by NG. So we're gonna get started on the heavies. So this is one you have not seen yet. This is my British Airways 747-400 in one of the retro liveries. And this one, um, this one's a really cool model. Um, so we have that one, that's by Gemini Jets. My, um, Triple Seven Two Hundred by Gemini Jets. That's the um, that's a two thousand release. Um, Triple Seven Two Hundred ER by Gemini Jets. 
We have my first Atlantic K3 4600 by Phoenix. You have not seen that one yet either. Um, and my EasyJet A3 5900 by um, Gemini, or by NG Models. We have my KLM um, 7A710 by um, NG Models. My Air France um, 7A79 by Aviation 400. My first Aviation 400, my first normal Air France plane and my latest model to my collection. Um, definitely a fine addition to my collection, for sure. Um, we have the Concorde as well, the Air France Concorde, and the French B A350. For the longest time, that was my only, that and my Beluga were my only French planes. So I'm super excited to finally have a, um, finally have some actual like French carriers, like fleet. So that's really cool. Moving on out of Lufthansa. A340-300, Gemini Jets, A3, or 747-8, um, Phoenix. Oh, and this one, um, this Concorde is by, um, Concorde is a, um, that's one of those you buy on eBay or like 17 bucks. And then the, um, French B is by NG. Then the Eta A330-200 by Gemini Jets, and the Swiss MD-11 by Gemini Jets. That one is a really cool plane. Um, it's one I haven't seen yet. But it's a really sick airplane. I really like it. Moving on to um, Aeroflot, we have my IL-62 and my IL-96. LL, we have my 787-9. Cutter, we have my 777-300ER. That's one you haven't seen yet either. Um, that one's new. That was part of the um, my, my birthday haul that I got. Um, I bought three planes from West Coast Diecast. I bought that one, the um, Korean a380 that you're going to see in a little bit in my version Atlantic. So, yeah, and then my um, Etihad um, A330. That one hasn't been in a long time. I picked it up to put it on, on this table and it was like super dusty. You might, I don't know if you can see it or not. I wiped some of it off, but it was, it was, it was bad. Um, all right, so now we have my Emirates um, A380. 777X. This is one you haven't seen yet. We're moving into Southeast Asia. Um, we have my Singapore Airlines A380. This one's by Dragon Models. And this one um, has the small titles, which is really cool. And then my Thai Airways um, 787. Air China 748i. China Eastern um, A330. Um, so we're moving into China with those two. We have my Korean um, A380. That one's a new one. And my Triple Seven by um, Asiana. My A and A Seven A Seven Dash Ten. My Qantas A380. My Mandarin Seven Four Seven SP. And my Dragon Air A320. Um, so plane has really grow the entire international fleet. Um, I want I I really want to get an Azul A350. Azul is really cool, and I really want to get it. Um. Let's see. Also, let's see. Add like Latam, Turkish, Avianca on the heavies um, as well. And just kind of go from there. I really want to add a Japan Airlines plane, a new Qantas, um, China Airlines, um, a new Livery Emirates plane, um, another China Eastern plane, and. Um, uh, updated British Airways plane, maybe a triple seven three hundred ER or something. Um, but anyway, so that's the um, commercial passenger section. I'm gonna move on now. Um, moving on now to this um, to my cargo slash military. So we're gonna start back. We're gonna start up he back here actually with this um, with UPS. We have the seven fifty seven two hundred by Gemini Jets. Um. 763 by Gemini Jets, MD11 by Gemini Jets, and the 744 by Gemini Jets. FedEx um, 767 by Gemini Jets. DHL 738 by Gemini Jets. This is one of the only models that I would not recommend. Um, the mold is horrible. It's It looks sloppy. Um, so I would not recommend that model at all. It just looks super sloppy. It's one of the worst planes in my collection. Um... And then the DHL-2204, this one has the Russian registration. 
National um, 7400. Oh gosh, that one is real dusty. Yeah, I haven't I haven't touched this model in a long time actually. Korean Air Cargo sm 48 i This one was also it was pretty dusty, but I dusted some of it off before I put it up here. Yeah, really um really cool plane. This one's by Dragon Models. Airbus Beluga, um, Azure thirty seven hundred by um, by J C Wings. Then we have this um. AM124, Volga, Volga, um, I don't even know how to, I don't want to pronounce that wrong, um, anyway, um, uh, this one's just, like, plastic, it's literally just plastic, um, I paid $25 for it on Waffle Collectibles, because I needed, I wanted an Antonov, so I got that one, then we have my AM225, the classic AM225, we have my, um, C5, we're in military now, by the way, we have my C5, C-17, KC-135, and B-1. So now I have the E-4 Nightwatch and the VC-25A Air Force One. I want to get the B model, this Dash 8, um, because, well, that's actually going to be a few years before they upgrade that plane. Um, it's kind of, I don't know. Anyway, um, but yeah, that's the, um, that's the collection update. I believe I have 114 planes. Um, I keep track of all my planes, um, with notes on my phone. Um, basically the plan is I want to get a McDonald Douglas, the Mad Dogs, one of them by NG. Um, I want to get an Azul A350. I want to get some, um, more of those, but those two, those two are the primary ones that I want. I want a triple seven as well, and a Delta triple seven, um, and a Mad Dog, of course. But I mean, I, I and a Breeze A two twenty, a few more Spirit, a few more Frontier stuff. You know, I was in Orlando the other day, um, and I saw that we had drove down there, but um, I saw a, I think it was Missouri one. Um, we were driving right by the airport, and I saw Missouri one flying over, so that was really cool. Um, they also had some Frontier stuff, some Spirit stuff. Um, and then while I was down there, I found out that Delta was starting flights from Orlando to London this winter. So, on the 330neo. So, I might have to do an Orlando update pretty soon, just to kind of play around with it. But, um, I don't know. That's literally just something I just thought of. I need more spirit and frontier before I get that. Like a lot more of those. Um, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll be um, seeing y'all in the next one. Bye.